I think these witnesses both saw the same person. Where he sexually assaulted her. The lowest person in, in, that you can be. He is a... He doesn't deserve well, to breathe another breath. What's up? Well, it's my first vlog. Never did one before. I'm gonna make this shit regular. I'm up at the crack of crack. Crack of crack. It's like a far ass drive to this venue, like three hours away, and I think the wedding starts at like four or five or something, so I'm gonna get my ass together. So here we go. Bro, get off the counter. Get off the counter. Get off the counter. Being that I'm new to this vlog shit. I'm just gonna record everything. Play it safe. And if I include it in the video, I include it in the video. I don't know. I might not include this part. I might include this part. Oh. So last night I reached out to everybody on my story. Uh, gonna start vlogging my life tomorrow. What should I include in my vlogs? So, got a few answers on that. Some are solid, some are, I don't know, dumb. Alright. More Jedi tips and cri tricks. Cricks. Tricks. Okay, Mike, I'll do that. Behind the scenes of SC, show the piles of gear. DJs love gear. All right, I got all the gear, Rick. You drinking White Claws, and that's it. We can include some of that, Brandon. Mixes, mobile DJ setups, gigs, equipment info. Got plenty of that, sir. What separates a good wedding DJ from a great one? Okay, I'll try and answer that one. Why is this working now? Here's my little brother. Oh, so now you're literally going to have a camera on your big ass head 24-7. All right, let's get dressed. Wait a second, wait a second. I learned a trick last night. I was watching videos and how to do this shit. All right, so I'm gonna go get ready, right? I gotta shave it, a shower, whatever, okay? I'm gonna go get ready, but I'm gonna put my hand over top of the lens, and then when I take my hand off the lens, I'm gonna be all ready already. Does that make sense? Okay, bye. And voila! Oh, I forgot to fucking fix my hair. <sighs> voila! Ha ha, see? Was it like magical and shit? Dude, you know how I'm gonna get fucked up this weekend? So. Two weddings, both groups names are Justin. Well, that's easier. No, it's not. See, see when it's two separate for me, because the way my head works, when it's like two separate names, it's not that bad. You know, if it's like Santi and Maria and Nick and Steph. It's two separate names. But if it's Justin and Melanie, first Justin and Lee, then Justin and Melanie, my brain tomorrow gonna is going to be like, Justin and Melanie! Right? Let's go get our shit, shall we? Get our shit, shit. We got to go get the shit. Santi kills the Tetris, see? That leans on that, and 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 then nothing moves. You guys talk shit about Jersey all you want, but we don't have to pump our own gas. 144 miles, two hours and 28 minutes. That's not that bad. Santi editing the photos for the gram. I'm hitting the rumble strips. Die. So I'm a rookie vlogger and only have one battery for my camera and it's already dying. So I ordered another one, but I should have two batteries. I didn't think about that. Don't judge me. I gotta stop and piss. I gotta piss. Yeah, Woodrow Wilson probably rolling in his grave mad as hell that they named this shitty ass rest stop after him. Yeah, how you doing? How you doing? Yeah, how you doing? How you doing? Thank you. Thanks. What's up? All right, so it definitely died mid talk last time. Um, in the meantime, me and Santi loaded in, set up, and uh, it is 3.08, ceremony starts at 4.30, so we're gonna go find some lunch. So we're up in the mountains in North Jersey, and there's no fucking service up here. So, for lack of service and lack of anywhere, we're in like the middle of nowhere, we're gonna go eat at Quick Check. Quick Check is like a Wawa, only uh, way better, way better. I mean, anything's better than Wawa. Don't at me. I don't care. Wawa sucks. Actually, now that I think about it, before you guys even leave that comment saying that, oh, Wawa's so much better, Wawa's the best, I love Wawa, I'll tell you right now, 
why Quick Check is better than Wawa. And pretty much everything is. Sheets is like the all time best, but I'll give Quick Check like a close second. Watch. Number one, the store is cleaner, better selection, fried food. They got fried food back there, which opens up a whole range of munchies that you can get, okay? 10 times better. Soup bar, a soup bar. Does Wawa have a soup bar? Nope. There's self checkout. So you can be in and out, you don't have to wait for someone from Wawa to check you out. And after my demonstration, if you really think Wawa's better, leave a comment and we can argue it out, okay? Because there's nothing you could say. Like, trust me, Wawa is trash. Yeah, trash. Yo, and Wawa don't got no management like this. Shout out to Amy with the bangs. Killing the bang game. Hell yeah. <laughs> don't tell her I said that. Appreciate it. She's got great bangs though. All right, so we're back. It's a it's literally an old barn, like silos and everything. That they, they kind of like remodeled into like a wedding venue, which is kind of cool. Porona Farms. Porona. Every time I put the camera on Santi, he puts his arms up. <laughs> Just does do. a Jesus pose every time. I don't know what to do. All you got is a Jesus pose? That's all I got. All right, so we got the big ass furniture case out here because there was no room for it upstairs. They don't have anywhere to spot it or um, hide it or whatever. Hopefully it doesn't rain, but it looks like a nice day. Now that I said that, it's probably gonna storm. All right, what's up? So we're all set up, we're good to go. Um, I'll kind of show you around the venue. The venue's pretty cool, so check it out, ready? So it's an old ass barn that they remodeled, made a little ceremony space, pretty cool. They serve everything family style. So you see it's like longer tables instead of the circle tables. So I typically use furniture. I have two Reloop 7000s built into a furniture piece, right? It's kind of all in one, pre-wired. I have an S9 mixer. And then, you know, your standard Serato and all that good fun stuff. Now there is rules today, specifically this rule. Oh, no bueno. And this rule, base levels, not good, not good. With that being said, I brought out the monsters today. Uh, HDM 45 tops. I have my 8,004 subs, all RCF of course, dual. So on the loud side, uh, but we'll try and like, you know, keep them down or whatever. Lighting control over there, that's where Santi's gonna be working and stuff. 16 space rack with the sound and all that good stuff. And then everything else we got back here, a little cooler for water, any bags and stuff. We had to load in through these steps. So, didn't have a lot of room for bags. Put bags over here. So that's it for the setup. We don't have a lot of lighting today or anything like that. Just uh, kind of your basic sound setup. And uh, they're gonna be coming up here in about 15 minutes or so. So I think right now, I'm gonna go see if there's anything good to eat in cocktail hour. Grub a little bit and uh, we'll get this party started. Let's go. So I left my case outside. I thought it was a good spot, but I guess not. So they just called me and said I have to move it. I don't know how they noticed it. Oh. I don't know how, it's not even that big, right? I just need to find a spot to put it. Can you see where I put it? Or is it disguised? Can you see it? Can you see it? How about now? Can you see it yet? Can you see it yet? Can you see it? So what's up everybody? How's everybody doing? Can you hear me in the back over there? Can you hear me in the back? Back table, make some noise for me. Just making sure. Welcome to the beautiful Perona Farms. My name is Nick Spinelli, the SC Event Group. We have Santa behind the DJ booth right now. But as you know, we're here to celebrate the marriage of Justin and Lee. Can we give it up for them real quick? Let's hear from Justin and Lee. They just got married outside. So uh, you remember how I said uh, put my case out here? It doesn't look like it's gonna rain. Remember how I said that? Hopefully it doesn't rain, but it looks like a nice day. Now that I said that, it's probably gonna storm. Yep. So now, luckily there's a fire out here going. Come on, really drying out the inside of my case. Yo, Yo Santi just taught me a new word. Well, <laughs> it's not a word, it's a phrase. Uh, but it means one thing, it's um, uh, hot ass beat clap. 
So uh, why don't you uh, explain to YouTube what the fuck is a hot ass beat clap? A hot ass beat clap is simply a banger. That's simply all it is. So instead of basically saying banger, like that shit's banger, that's a fire, like whatever, like saying one word, banger, two syllables, right? You say, that's, <laughs> that shit's a hot ass beat clap. Like, imagine if you're like in a fucking loud like room or something, like you're at a concert, and you're like, yo, this is a hot ass beat clap. What? Like, you know what I mean? You're not gonna be able to hear what? Hot ass beat clap. What? Because banger, if you're if you're mouthing it from a fucking across the fucking venue at a concert or some shit, can look like a wanger. And that's a whole other word. <laughs> you look like a Sith Lord. A what? Oh, you don't watch Star Wars. What's a Sith Lord? Like a, he's on his, uh, he's like one of the bad guys. Like, who looks like that? You look like that with this red ambiance. Cause I got red on me. I'm, I look like a bad guy. Yeah. Say I'm a bad guy. What are you fucking Billy Ellish? She makes the hot ass beat claps. <laughs> <laughs> Don't call it that. I'll never listen to her again now. All right. What is it? 304. 304 just got home. Long day, people. Long day. Uh, me and Santi are meeting up at 11 tomorrow to grab breakfast and uh, head up to uh, wedding number two. So, see you then. All right. Good morning. What's up? Um, it's um, it's 10.37. Santi's meeting me in a couple minutes. I'm blurry, so why am I so blurry? There I am. Hi. There. Um, it's 10.37. Santa's meeting me at 11 o'clock. I just woke up. I gotta get my shit together. Um, see you in a little bit. See you in a little bit. See you once I'm done. Get my shit together. See you in a little bit. A little bit. Okay. What's up, Cheesy Keeps? How you doing, little boy? Sorry we left you out. How you doing? You alright, little boy? Every morning I try and get my shit together, I'm at my desk and Santi's here. What's up Santi? Round two. Round two. Gonna do another wedding. What I'm really excited about at the moment though is we're leaving a little early so we could stop at a place called La Hacienda Bakery for breakfast. Now, La Hacienda Bakery has the best damn breakfast sandwich on earth. Plus, they have this coffee. And instead of using milk, they use this shit called leche. There it is. Violence best kept secret. La Hacienda. I'm gonna send Santi in there because he speaks Spanish. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay out here. This is the La Hacienda number breakfast one. sandwich number one. Go glum. What happened? We're like in the boondocks. Like I don't know where we're going. Dude, yeah. you live in the boondocks. You live in the boondocks. No. I live in suburbia America. Suburbia America. Now where the fuck are we? Seriously. Oh, like, honestly, I'm telling you, I don't know where we're going. But it looks like Well, we're point seven we're miles away. We're about, I think we're gonna come out it's here. Like we're there. Just have eyes out here or something. No, I think we're here. We're gonna start seeing more civilization, don't worry. Alright, so we're here at Ryland Inn. Ceremony starts in approximately two hours and fifteen minutes. We gotta load in through here. A little bit of a situation and this thing's kind of in our way because I gotta like back in here so definitely got to move this really hipster looking smart car uh, it's tiny enough yo guys you think we can move this on our own like can we just pick this shit up oh by the way there's the pagalooch there's the pagalooch told you guys all about him there we go we're gonna come move the smart car then I'll back this shit over here how long do you think it's gonna take you? To back in? Two seconds. Shit. Has he gotten better? No. Why are you lying to his face? You know I got disgusting. Last night. 
I got sleepy. I wasn't backing in. I'm <laughs> disgusting at backing this shit up now. I don't know. I am dirty. We'll see. Bro, I backed that shit up in the pouring rain last night. Don't fucking run over my foot. So it looks like SC is taking his place over. We got JSG and Bird in the building. Well, in the other building. There's two ballrooms here, but on yeah. The, on the other side of the horse's ass. Yes, yeah. so I rented the, the Sony version of that for Ireland. You rented it? Yeah. So, so you're going to see if you like it? I'm see if I like it over the cannon. Cool. Well, so, we're going to find out. We're going to find out. So vlog's coming your way. JSG, follow him right. Um, I'm going to put it there. No, maybe there. No, maybe up near his head. It's going to be on the fucking screen. Anywhere. I'm super short. Sure it could fit anywhere on the screen. Right? That's it. There's Boom. It. All right, real quick. So. We're all set up. How you guys feeling? We're good. Got the lighting controls back here. Furniture up front. We do have up lighting today, so we'll turn those on real quick. A little bright, but you know, it'll do. It'll do once it gets darker out. I'm Hollywood. I'm so Hollywood. Hollywood. I'm so Hollywood. Gosh. That's what they don't show you. That's what they don't show you. They don't show that. They don't show that man. That manliness happened there. <gasps> Look at me drop. Look at me drop. Find her keeper. Find her keeper. If I can drop it, it's mine. It's mine. Done. Done. Mine. Cement top and muzzle top and muzzle top and cement top, cement top and muzzle top and muzzle top and cement top, cement top and muzzle top. Da 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 We were on our way home, but um, someone had to, someone had to piss over here. a common occurrence um typically santi loses well, one to four and a half things a week days. oh you found it yes oh wow almost I'll be right back almost fell asleep waiting for you Wait a, a great weekend any uh final words to the camera after the first vlog uh, we're, we're, we're concluding the first uh vlog how, how many? How many? How many bangerang? Uh, hot ass beat claps. How many hot ass beat claps did I play? At least twelve hot ass beat claps this weekend. Um, final words. Shit, it's only the beginning, dog. That's it. All right, I'm gonna do a nice uh, dramatic uh, pan out into the sky. Okay. All right. Yeah. Just look up. Ready.